Welcome back to the second episode of today's session. Currently just traveling the highway in the last episode. I was playing around with baritone, very successfully managed uh, to figure out how these highways were created and quickly uh, read it together um, with the help of uh, YouTube how how to well yeah run the commands um, that create these highways so it's just using the cell command um, which is a world edit like tool for baritone to select an area to select like a 3x3 three three air cube um, you can then do cell set air and then you do set build repeat and then you specify three directional parameters so you can say minus one zero minus one to go diagonal on the x and the z axis and stay like on the y axis at zero and this is how this three by three air cube is then repeatedly built or filled but actually just dug out in whatever direction you specified it to go. So that's how it's done. Um, it's really awesome how Baritone can do that for you. But it's even more amazing that we don't even have to do that. We don't have to break our pickaxes because somebody already did it for us, um, which is very convenient. So we can just keep on traveling. Um, yeah, like always. <laughs> but I don't feel the urge to keep talking for one hour about random stuff and what staring at this screen so I I'm gonna get AFK a bit you know do some stuff so I don't I don't get I don't get crazy here. I'm not losing my mind. Um, let me triple check we're walking in the right direction. At some point it has to happen to me that I'm walking in the wrong direction one full episode. <laughs> it will happen eventually. Um, yeah. But it hasn't happened so far and that's how the steady progress was made. I really do want to play Counter-Strike now, I'm, I'm not gonna lie, um, but I can't do that with this crap running in the background. Should I get my laptop and switch over there? I definitely would have to stop the recording. I can reconnect on my laptop without getting kicked from the queue, but I can't move over my, my OBS recording. So it will be a very short episode, which is also totally legal. Yeah, let me, let me. Let me get my laptop, see how much battery it has. If there are any hacks installed already. Stuff like that. Let's see. Let's give it a try. It's also super hot in here, so I definitely need another running device to heat the room up even more because I just love to sweat. Uh, yeah. Fucking hell. Um, anyways, so there's not much battery, so I need a charger very, very soon. Um, what does the hacking situation say we have? Um, we have no Lambda client here, is that possible? We have PolyMC installed, okay, that's a good start. We have 2v2t instance over here. Is it equipped with Kami or something like that? Definitely not going back to Kami. It seems unmodded. What happens if I join the proxy now? I will probably get kicked, right? 
Um, yeah, let's not do that. Um, edit instance settings mods. No nope. version install fabric. Why is it grayed out? Polyam C version one dot two. What Polyam C do I have here? One dot three. So I'm not the updatedest one can be. I wonder how I installed it. Um, Polyam C. Which Poly Poly? Which Polyam C user local bin? Uh, APG search Paul EMC. Nope. How do you list install packages? I probably installed it manually or some crap. Um, how do I update this shit now? Oh, classic DBM problem. Um, Holy MC. I remember there were so many install options and on Debian I was like really picking something. I think I installed it with the Debian helper thingy. Um, unable to locate package. No, I didn't. Uh, using an MBR Una update. Do I have Una? Nope. How did I install it? Download tar GZ. Did I really do that one? Portable app image. I might have just downloaded a tar. What else? Oh wow! I the fuck! No, I didn't do that. Now I have like. How did I install it? Did I just move the binary into user local? Yeah, maybe. Okay. So if I go to downloads now, I have bin and share. So sudo mv bin in user local bin. That should do. And then. Wait, no, 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 no. Now I have bin. I had to do bin star. Oh my gosh. Folder called bin and bin. Oh my goodness, I'm literally too IQ. Okay, so do sudo mv share star user local share cannot move applications to directory not empty how do I merge shit whatever if I start poly MC now use new default settings we are on the latest version okay cool so I can now edit my instance and I can still cannot install fabric why doesn't it let me install fabric wait lambda needs fabric 
right? Not forge. Let me check. It's our latest forge. It's forge. Okay. Yeah, no brain. Maybe it's a Minecraft version problem then. So let's install forge. And then let's clone lambda. Oh, there's a polyMC directory here. Oh, I think I. Oh, now I know how I install polyMC. I build it from source and did a make install properly. Oh boy, who would have guessed that? What a troll. Why is there a file called A? It's ASCII text and it's not tracked by Git. What the fuck? Is that in their repository? Is it in a Git ignore? How's there a file called A? Oh my goodness, I don't have anything configured here. Probably have like auto jump on and stuff. Oh no. Yeah, I will probably spend a whole session configuring my laptop instead of actually using it. What a pain, what a pain. Do I have the right Java version? Probably don't. Let's see. I swear it's using fabric, not forge. I'm so confused right now. Not gonna lie. Options, resource packs, open resource packs, folder, open terminal. Yep. Um, Update.sh. Finally, uh, build failed. Why did it fail? Unsupported class file made major version 61. Probably wrong Java version. Java minus version 17. Sudo apt no update. Alternatives configure Java. Oh my god. Change Java version Debian. It's I think it's somewhat Arch Linux Java or something like that. On Arch, Arch is just so much simpler when it comes to literally everything. Uh, I noticed that more and more when I the rarely I switch back to um, to Debian. I I noticed that I, I miss it. I do have. Java 8 installed. That's a win. Okay. Mm -hmm. So I should probably do a git pull here and reboot all EMC instead of. Now it's tracked. What happened? I'm on branch develop. Is that the default branch for all EMC? It is. Should I use that one? There's stable, there's release, there's. Yeah, I probably want to develop. How does one build it? Can I just run build? Nope, I can't. Um, ah, come on. Build MD. The website. 
git clone cd those packages mkdir install cd build configure the project tc make install prefix install install user component portable building installing it to the system user local yeah that's that's what i want Command not found. What? Bash command not found. Wait. Something went wrong here. Wait, is the other comments not working in a multi line? Oh, come on. Maybe that's what the R file contained. You have no idea what I'm doing right now. I'm just babbling. The source directory does not exist. Specify command not found. What? It's escaping the. Oh, there are spaces at the end. Oh, okay. Yeah, I guess that's it for today's session, right? Did the proxy just crash? Reading position in queue from tab failed. Is the queue empty? Is this, isn't it to be? The proxy didn't crash. I don't know. Something happened. Classic to be. Whatever. Um, so that's it for today's session. And I didn't manage to switch to the laptop. What a surprise. Uh, see you in the next session. Bye.